Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to play music through your Raspberry Pi. Now it's very simple uh, to play music through your Raspberry Pi, but it it's not as simple as uh, plugging your thing in and going away. It's plugging your uh, external hard drive in and you're away. It's slightly more complicated than that. You need to install a new uh, package onto your Pi called Mock, which stands for Music on Console. It's one of the most powerful uh, music players for for uh, the Raspberry Pi. To uh, install it, all you have to do is type in sudo apt-get install moc and then press enter. It will find all of the information on the ras on this uh, on mock and then ask you whether you want to install it or not. Once it's uh, finished doing this, it, this may take a while. Hmm. Usually asks you whether or not you want to continue, but it seems to have done it anyway. Okay, then you'll need to plug in your external uh, USB hard drive. Hold on. There you go. Once the uh, once your removable medium is inserted, all you need to do to get to mock to load it, all you have to do is type M O C P. Now the reason there's a P on the end of it is so that uh, it's not confused with another package known as called mock either. Now as you see, I've already. Uh, used it, but to get, it should be at home pi. This is the default directory that it will start up in. And to get to your external hard drive, just keep pressing the blank ones at the top. Let's see if I can zoom in on it here. You just keep clicking the blank area at the top until you get to here, and then scroll down to media which is the mount point in which, and then choose the name of your external hard drive. And then go through it until you find the folder that all your music is in. Better turn up the volume on this. So you can hear it. And then you go to, at the moment it can only play, uh, what is it, it can only play mp3 pile, um, only can play mp3 files and WAV files as far as I can see. It won't, won't play any default mp4 files uh, for that are used automatically by Windows. So let's see here. Let's put a little Bruce Springsteen on. Why not? As you go to any of your music, press enter to play. And then you can minimise it by pressing Q. And if you want, and uh, you can minimise your LXT terminal and go on and do other things. You could be browsing the web whilst you're doing this. Now just be warned it might take a little bit longer for stuff to come up. And the computer might be a little bit slower than normal. But uh, that can be that is to be expected. To pause the music, let's start this over. All you have to do is type mock P dash and a capital G. And the music is paused. Start it again, you type the same command. To skip to the next song in the directory or your playlist, you type mock p f. And it goes to the next song. To return to the last song, that you, the uh, so, la, before song in the directory, you type mock p r. And there you go. And then if you want to find out what song is playing, to print all the information from the song to the terminal, you, pre you do mock p i. And all the information comes up, including the total time, time left, current time, the bit rate, the average bit rate, and the, and the rate. To stop playback altogether and quit 
uh, music on console, you take mock P dash X. Now this not only stops the music but stops mock completely and shuts it down. That's all I can uh, feasibly tell you about mock. Hope you have uh, fun with it and uh, just remember if you can't find it, it's usually you can't if you can't find your external hard drive, it's usually listed under uh, in the root directory media and then the name of your external hard drive will be in there. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, I hope keep uh, posted for next week when I'll be showing you how to use OpenOffice on your Raspberry Pi. Thank you very much for watching. Please comment, rate and subscribe.